guys welcome to my channel where we'll be discussing family faith hope and love i'm so glad that you joined me let's be fed daily bread are you hungry message find you doing well if this is your very first time tuning in this is my digital journey I have been led by the Holy Spirit to drop you golden nuggets each and every day hello to my family and friends I hope all is well thank you guys for your love your support your encouragement I am so happy that you have joined me on this digital journey today is episode 138 day 138 the topic of conversation for today the word is flourish flourish when I got the word from the Holy Spirit, I was like, okay, Holy Spirit, based on what it is I have been talking about for the previous episode, I can see exactly where the Holy Spirit is coming with, what direction that the Holy Spirit is going. So, I took some time, did some research to see what scriptures they have, in the Bible, what is the meaning of flourish, of course, and see exactly what the Holy Spirit wanted me to deliver to you today. Based on my understanding, I literally believe that the Holy Spirit is taking this to the next dimension. Yes, all my episodes have been, you know, dropping golden nuggets here and there, but more than likely it's for those or was marketing those that um, were not sure, you know, undecided, or just in the beginning stages of having, um, trying to build a relationship with God. Um, but I think this particular message is more for an advanced crowd. I'm saying that because think about um, those who have been doing everything that they're called to do, they know their purpose, um, they're reading the Bible, they're, they're doing the scripture, but then it's like, whatever it is, they're like in the a holding cotton, they're like standing still in where they're at. They're trying to figure out, well, what is the next step for me? And I think this is what the Holy Spirit wants to make sure that you hear today. I know this is definitely for me because when the Holy Spirit told me flourish, I was like, okay, based on everything that I read and what I saw, I was like, yeah, this is definitely for taking it up to another notch, another dimension, okay? Um, flourishing is what is God's actual intentions for the world. That's what he intended from the onset, is for us to flourish, okay? We are called by God to be good stewards of everything that he has given us, okay? We're not supposed to hoard stuff for ourselves. We're supposed to share. We're supposed to be helping people. We flourish, we help other people flourish. That is what we're supposed to be doing, okay? Um, only mature believers is going to get this because there's a lot of people that they know what they're supposed to do, but they don't necessarily do it for a lot of different reasons. Um, but I think what the Holy Spirit wants you to dive right in into what needs to be done in order for you to see yourself flourishing. Um, you know, in the scripture, it tells you whatever you sow is what you reap. 
So let me tell you what flourishing looks like. It's like you're happy and you're complete. Um, you have positive emotions. Your mentally and your physical health is great. You have meaning and purpose. You're in close relationships. You're executing the wisdom that you're learning. You're executing it in your day-to-day -day life. Um, you have courage. You show kindness and compassion to others. Um, and you just, it's everything. is just optimal well-being. I would say good vibes, great energy. Okay, that's how you're in that flourishing stage, that flourishing environment, okay? And then for those of you who are mature and advanced and you want to know, well, how would I be able to flourish? Is there something that I need to do to be able to flourish? Here are some pointers. Um, practice gratitude. Um, be the best of yourself. Do random acts of kindness. Um, get your needs met. Fulfillment. You've got to be fulfilled for in order for you to be in that flourish stage. Um, always be optimistic. You know, we are led to believe and to believe that all things are possible. No matter what is transpiring, just always be optimistic and be positive and believe that you can go as far as you want to go because you're with God. You have positive expectations, okay? And the scripture that the Holy Spirit wanted to bring to your attention today is Psalms 92, 13. And it says that they that are planted in the house of the Lord, they will flourish in the courts of our God. So for you who are mature and you're ready to go to that next stage, the next dimension, the flourishing stage, um, try the tips that I just left you um, because I know this is definitely something that I definitely needed to hear and looked into. Um, because we always want to know what's next and I am so ready to flourish in every area of my life so the question that I have for you each and every day is are you hungry I know that I am let's be fed daily